playing devil's advocate with myself is very, very hard. It's like a 24-hour thing because I know there's a possibility that people are gonna come after me. They're not gonna understand, so I have to be ready. It's like MMA, be ready. In Oklahoma, they know me as the basketball player and they get a sense of who I am as a person through basketball, but still feels like they don't know the real me. Yeah! Here, you have to have your game face on. Fallon. Fallon Fox. Fox. Fallon Fox. She is an MMA fighter. It's not her undefeated record that has everyone talking. She is a transgender female. It, it's an advantage over a woman, you know? Oh, oh. That's it, Fallon Fox. Some people believe I have an automatic advantage, but if they look into the science of it and what the hormones do to the body, it dissipates. I'll whip her. I mean, I'll whip it. Some of society just doesn't get it yet. And this is what we're trying to do right now is to inform people and let them know about transgender athletes. Why do you feel that that is important to come out to say, I am gay? For a while it was, okay, I can deal with people not knowing, but now it eats at me to not be truthful to people. I just, I don't know how to go about it. For the first time, an active male player in a major team sport has announced today that he is gay. How's it going, man? Good, good. I applaud you for having that strength to you know, accept who you are, because it took me a long time. There's no love here in Miami for fellow talks. I mean, trans people can go out there being in MMA fighter. It's so hard. It's going to take time to actually get to where we really, really know each other. I don't know what I'd do without her. <laughs> It's like a feeling in your stomach. Just tell someone, just tell everybody, get it over with. I'm a fighter. You fight until the fight's done. You fight until it's, it's the end. That's what I'm doing. I'm gonna fight until the end. I'm not gonna take the easy ride out.